The race for Youngstown mayor, well, it's getting more crowded. Look for possibly more candidates by Monday night. That's the deadline for anyone running as non-party candidates. And as First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti tells us, the latest to throw her hat into the ring would like to be the last one. Five days before Tuesday's primary and four days ahead of the deadline to file, former Youngstown Councilwoman Janet Tarpley brought her petitions to run for mayor to the Board of Elections this morning. Being as an independent, I'll be open to represent everyone. Tarpley spent eight years on council. She could be among three potential non-party or independent candidates who would face the eventual Democrat nominee, either incumbent John McNally or former councilman Jamail Tito Brown. She admits she wanted to avoid a contested primary against Brown since he lost four years ago to McNally by less than 150 votes. He was very close to winning. And once again, if I would have jumped in uh, in the primary, uh, I don't think that I would have had a good chance at all. At this point, former City Hall employee Sean McKinney says he will file to run Monday, and previous candidate Cecil Monroe has also taken out petitions for the mayor's race. Tarpley is already questioning their motives. If somebody's jumping in and they know they're not going to win, then what are they here for? Are they really here to make sure I'm not going to win? Turnout for the race could be dismal. To date, less than 3,000 absentee and early in-person ballots have been taken out for all of Mahoning County. The two Democratic candidates tell me they're focused on getting out the vote. I really can't worry about folks who want to take the job uh, until after the evening of May 2nd. Um, for the next five days, we'll keep knocking on doors. My job is to get voters to go out and vote. And we need to take them to the polls. We need to find them. Um, that's going to be my job for the next five days, getting the voters to the polls. We'll see which does a better job of that. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.